It's spooky season. I'm pumpkin skin, but you can't see my eyes. And we're on the new Bedwars map. Or rather, one of the two Bedwars maps. There's two new Bedwars maps. And I'm- it's inside a pumpkin. So yeah, the uh- oh my gosh, that's so fast. This is so fast. Oh wow. The spooky update came out. So now Hypixel is just slightly more spooky. I'd say like 30 to 35% more. So there's this map. I don't know. I think it's called Darken. And there's some other map, which I don't know what it's called. I have the forms post up right here. And I'll read it when I'm not speed bridging. But first impressions of this map, the iron generation is super fast, which is always a good thing. Faster paced gameplay. There should be a guy here, right? Yeah, where is he? You're going over there? That's fine. Oh, and there's pumpkins now. Welcome back to the pumpkinator. I can turn those in and get... There's a quest, I think. So basically all the uh, pumpkin thing is, is that every time you get a bed, you get a couple pumpkins. Every time you get a final kill, you get a couple pumpkins. And every time you get a kill, I think you get one pumpkin. And then when you click on the shopkeeper, you automatically receive the pumpkins. And then if you have a bunch of pumpkins, you get like a quest. I don't know. I'm pretty sure the only use is for a quest. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that's all it is. Now, okay, Blue's in here and he does not have a bed. Can I kill him? Okay, that was a good use of a fireball. I played on this map for about 45 seconds and I already think it's pretty good. I like it. I like the look of it. I don't know exactly what it feels like to play yet because I've only played for like, you know, two minutes, but it looks pretty cool. Like, <laughs> freaking jack-o'-lantern with a top hat. That's that's a great combination. I mean, I know that's an island topper and not part of the map, but you, you know what I'm saying. Am I... I'm dead. He's utilizing the fact that it's really fast iron generation and he, he fireballs. All right, screw it. I'm going to fireball jump to him. Haha, -ha. I don't know if the fireball did anything there, because I, I just don't think it did. But my mind fatigue sure did. Alright, this guy knows what he's doing, clearly, so I need to actually start trying here. Uh, I want a fireball. Yes, thank you. I'm assuming he's gonna have a fireball, so I need to be aware of that at all times. I just need to make sure I don't get fireballed off. Okay, so he's just chilling up there. I might be able to fireball jump, I'm not sure. Okay, I think I can go to his bed and then void in time. Unless he has a fireball. He probably has a fireball, I just need to watch out. Wait, he might even get to my bed in time, no way. Please don't have mind fatigue. Okay, he doesn't. Can I get to his bed in time? Do I have a trap? I think I have a trap, right? I'm pretty sure I have a trap. Alright, I got him. I got him. Let's go. Whew, I got a little nervous there. I'm not gonna lie. I was kind of nervous. Anyways, uh, uh, my first nine weeks at school just ended, so a little more stress, or a little less stress, rather. The last week has been a little stressful just because I've had to worry about all the grades and making sure I don't accidentally forget to turn in something, because... I'd be stupid, but now that um, half of the semester is over, I can relax for just a little bit. I can take like a single breath and then we're back at it on Monday. Pink is just chilling over there, huh? I'm gonna say I really like this map. Wait, wait, is he AFK? Hello? Okay. Cool. Okay. <laughs> All right, I'm back on this map because the other one wasn't available and I don't feel like waiting. Sometime in this video, you'll see the other map. It just wasn't available right now. No, this is a really bad idea. I, I tried to see if I could buy a stone sword, tools, and a fireball, and it just doesn't work out. How far of a rush is this map? Can I make it with 48 blocks? I'm pretty sure I can. Well, he's rushing either way, so I wouldn't be able to tell. Probably defend my bed then. And he fell into the void. Okay. I'm running pretty low on blocks, but I do have a fireball if all else fails. All right, got him. Am I gonna burn to death? No. The red's hanging out over here. Hello, red team. I'm gonna go get your bed. What? No way! I should probably read the forums post pretty soon, but right after I kill Pink because he seems to be wanting to kill me. So what are you doing down there, sir? You have a knockback stick. I'm not a fan of that. Okay. Oh no, I'm on fire. Not this again. Please, please no. Crossing my fingers that pink doesn't break my bed while I'm over here. He probably will, but please don't. Hello, red. Okay, goodbye. I don't know how much time I have before pink gets here, so I gotta go fast. Oh! Oh, he bamboozled me! He got me! There was- he- he did the thing! He did the defense where it's actually right here. I'm so dumb. That's actually really smart of him because it's a new map, so no one's gonna know where the bed's supposed to be. Okay, he's gone. I'm gonna jump into the void and cross my fingers that I don't lose my bed. Okay, no. Pink's going to Aqua now, so we're good. Anyways, forms post. Basically, uh, all that matters to Bed Wars is that they added two new solo and doubles maps, Trick or Treat and Darkened. I'm playing on Darkened right now, so Trick or Treat is the other one. Some sprays, some cosmetics, spooky chests, the normal. Spooky Speedway and a couple other spooky maps, I think. How many times will I say spooky in this video? I don't know, a lot. Yeah, I think it's just a usual update. Like, so they reskinned a couple maps, added some cosmetics, uh, spooky chests, and then they added two new maps, which is actually not, not terrible. It could be worse. Honestly, probably one of the better Halloween updates they've had. I don't think they've uh, added 
exclusive maps before for Halloween. Or maybe they have, and I'm just dumb. All right, I'm gonna bring a fireball because I need a fireball to jump to him because he's gonna have a fireball. Okay, I think he's dead. He's not dead, he's on like zero health. Okay, I got him. Firewalls are so fun. I love them so much, and this map generates iron so fast. Ah, oh, it's amazing. So, just gray and pink left. They're both bedless. Hello, sir. You have a knockback stick, which means I'm gonna go right over you and stay at your base so you can't hit me off. That sounds like a good plan. Then I will purchase multiple more fireballs and go to your friend's base. I probably should have bought a gap if I was smart, but hey, I'm not smart, so it's whatever. Where's gray? He's not at his base, which makes me think he's at my bed. I hope not. No, he's at middle. Uh-oh. No. <laughs> so, I want to kill him at middle, preferably before he has the chance to use all of his emeralds. That would be a good thing. He does have sharp iron, which means there's a very low chance I'm gonna be able to actually kill him, because I have just a normal stone sword. Unless he just does this and lets me hit him off. Okay. I mean, that works. Oh, I got some of the quests. Nightmares. Break four beds and win two. That's a nice quest. What's the other quest? It's like 99 pumpkins. Okay. All right. I'm finally like 10 minutes later. I'm on the new map. Iron also generates really fast on this, which is already a good thing. I guess I'll just go rush. I have 40 iron and it's 20 seconds into the game. So that means it's generating iron like two per second, which is very fast. Is it better diagonal rush or sideways rush? Okay. He's going that way. That's cool. I'll go this way. So what is this map called? It's like Trick or Treat, I think. I don't know anything about it. How far is it to bridge? This seems like a far distance. Is this a 64 rush? Please don't tell me this is 64. And what I mean by 64 is that it takes 64 blocks to get there. It's a 64 rush and you can't even build up that much. What are you, are you serious? Come at me, lemon man. I'm juking him. Oh, I got his ankles. Oh, he can't get me. I should probably kill him. Finish the job. All right, that's a really weird generator. It's way off center. I know it was like a stylistic choice, but I just don't like it. I just don't like maps in general where you, uh, where the generator isn't directly behind you when you start. It just seems like a very slight annoyance that's completely unnecessary. Like if you, if you want to put the generator off center, just move the spawn point like right here instead of in the middle. So this place is like a house. What's up here? A balcony, very nice, very nice. Is there like an inside to the house? No, but you can come up here. So Gray's still fighting him. I'll just go get diamonds, I guess. Diamonds are a decent amount lower than the than the regular islands and then middle is slightly higher than diamonds. So everything's a different elevation level. That, that's unique. It's not a flat map, which isn't a great thing, but also isn't terrible. I don't know. I'm looking at this from very different perspectives. One, just how unique is it? Another is just gameplay. Like how good is it to actually play? And then a the third is just how it looks. You need a good balance of all three to be like, you know what? top tier bed wars map a good example of something that's good in all aspects is speedway speedway is unique it's very flat like no other map is that flat and is that like open uh it's it looks nice it's like a racetrack and it plays nice anyways i should probably go kill this guy my birthday is in three weeks from yesterday ow where'd he go oh he died no no please wait please tell me i can kill you I got him, let's go. Anyways, I'm gonna turn 16 years old, which is, that's weird. I'm, I don't wanna be 16. That means I actually have to be like mature and smart and know where I'm going in life. I'm a Minecraft YouTuber, that's not, that's not a good thing. I'm really worried that like the news, the local news is gonna like try to interview me and then everyone around town is gonna know. And it's gonna be just the worst thing ever because no one's gonna ever let me forget it. You know, like year 2072, my 50 year uh, reunion, everyone's gonna talk about, oh guys, do you remember Grayson's Minecraft channel? It's gonna be terrible. Oh, whoops. So listen, so I'm in this history class. It's pretty easy. It's honors, but it's, it's still easy. And during the uh, the whole nine weeks, I have like a 99 in the class. So everything's looking great. And then I take this quiz today, no idea what's going on. I don't know why. Like I pay attention in class, I take notes, but I just didn't know what the quiz was gonna be on because she wasn't really clear and it was a half day. And I get a 65 on the quiz, a 65. And then I'm like, oh, that's okay. I already have a 99 in the class. It'll bring my grade down by like half a percent, maybe a whole percent. And then she says it's going in the next quarter grade. So I'm gonna start off quarter two with a 65 in the grade book. And I'm gonna have to spend the whole couple, first couple weeks building that grade back up. And I'm upset. Hello, Aqua, how are you doing? You're you're gonna die, aren't you? Yeah, yeah, he is. And then my mom's gonna be like, Grayson, why do you have a 65 in that class? I thought you said it was easy. And then freaking stupid Charles the first, go have a glorious revolution somewhere else. He kept talking about how we're gonna know the, uh, the order of the monarchs and then they just didn't show up on the quiz, I'm pretty sure. Anyways, I'm gonna go kill, I'm gonna go kill this guy. Don't do it. I know you, don't do it. You have another one. Don't, 
I- why would you do that? There's no reason to do that. I mean, sure, you could argue, he was trying to not die. Why- but so what? I'm really excited because my basement being renovated, um, if you're an active viewer of my channel, you've heard me talk about that before. It's gonna get done, like, today or tomorrow or the next day. And then I can move my computer down there sometime within the next week. And then that means, like, in October, 24-hour live stream. Let's go. So that means I'll have a more spacious room. I'll be able to be on my computer later because my mom won't have to go to sleep. I mean, my mom's still gonna go to sleep, but it's in a location where she won't hear me when I'm talking. Because previously what happened is my mom is directly below me and uh, the floorboards are kind of creaky. So so she can hear me and of course me talking she can lightly hear everything's gonna be great where is this guy again what color is he yellow he's not gonna like break my bed is he is he i can't build there oh he is gonna break my bed good thing i died then he is fire hey don't you fireball don't you fireball that that's rude of you do i not have a trap what i, I what I was relying that whole time that I would have a trap, but I guess I just didn't. I'm genuinely surprised I didn't lose my bed then. I'm going to watch the Joker movie tonight. I've heard it's like dark, but it's good. I don't really know. I haven't watched a movie in theaters in months, so this is going to be fun. Also, both my brothers are home. They haven't been home in a while. One of them is in college, like two and a half hours away. And then the other one lives up near Washington, D.C., which both are pretty far away. So the fact that they're both here this weekend is pretty cool. Ah, uh, look how much iron I have. Oh my gosh. I should probably buy a trap, shouldn't I? Wouldn't that be a smart thing to do? Yeah, I just didn't have it. Wow. I genuinely surprise myself with how stupid I am sometimes. He's coming over here. I have three fireballs I can abuse. He has a fireball. He definitely has at least one fireball, yeah. Hello? Hello, hello? I'm being really annoying here with these fireballs. I feel kind of bad. Someone's getting a little feisty. Hello, sir. I'm gonna fireball jump over you. All right, well, I'll see you around. He's getting mad at me for fireball jumping. Imagine. Hello. Thank you. Let's go. Half a heart, not even close. I just want to finish off this video saying that I, uh, I think the update's pretty good. I like it. One of the better Halloween updates, if not the best, just for the fact that they added two new maps, which I think are pretty good. I can't find too many major negatives. Sure, they're not perfect. Sure, they're not the best maps out there, but they're pretty good. And of course, you have the usual cosmetics and stuff, which nobody really cares about, but that's okay. I, uh, I tryharded this for like 45 minutes earlier, and I got to number three, but I'm kicked back down to number five. It's okay. Let me know your thoughts on the update in the comments below. Um, let me know if there's anything I missed, because there's a decent chance there is. But other than that, uh, thank you guys so much for watching to the end of the video. I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye. They want a story, I'ma tell them that. They want to see I got the visions, want the change, I'll make the difference. And you know that I'll be searching till I bring it back. Yeah, I went through hell and back to find myself, but I am not the same as who I like. No.